but more importantly than that, Charlemagne says Kanye West screamed at him over Pete Davidson. We are going to look at what the Charlemagne quote was, by the way. Obviously, Charlemagne, a bit of a media demon, not the most reliable person. I don't know, but but this quote is pretty funny, so I'm just going to read it regardless. He's basically trying to get me on board to shit on somebody he knows is my friend. Pete Davidson, the radio vet, began. He's like, we got to save the new Marilyn Monroe. Talking about Kim. I'm like, you know Pete is my friend, right? After going on and on for a while, Charlemagne claims the Donda rapper began barking at him about Davidson's member, allegedly screaming, my wife is out here fucking a white boy with a 10-inch penis and you won't help me? My wife is out here fucking a white boy with a 10-inch penis and you're telling me that's your friend, but you're supposed to be culture? What I'm supposed to do, but... What am I supposed to do but laugh at that, he questioned with a chuckle before reminding listeners on his, of his March 2022 Donkey of the Day entry that alluded to West being jealous of Davidson's size as he played Beyonce's ego. Here it is. Kanye got into an argument. He called me uh, last November. It was Taylor. No, everybody, I told you, it's because it's, it's hilarious. I didn't want him to have my new number. Mm-hmm. He's got uh, people calling me to get my new. I doubt it, by the way. I don't believe that Charlemagne the God does not want Kanye to be able to reach him. Okay? That's, that's Cap. I just don't. Like. New number. Whatever, whatever. I'm sitting outside the passport office getting the passport for my daughter. We could be about to go out the country after Thanksgiving. I'm like, all right, fuck it. He calls me. <laughs> He's basically trying to get me on board to shit on somebody he knows is my friend, Pete Davidson. Mm. Like, you got it. You're not calling me just to call me. You know Pete is my friend, right? right? Nori told, like, Nori's like, you know, that's Charlamagne's guy. So you're calling me. He's like, oh, you know, um, oh, you know, you, we got to save the new Marilyn Monroe. You know what happened to Marilyn Monroe, right? Marilyn Monroe died of drug addiction. So we got to save the new Marilyn Monroe. Talking about Kim. Mm. And I'm like, yo, you know, Pete is my friend, right? So he's going on and on. And then he, finally he goes, my wife is out here fucking a white boy with a 10-inch penis and you won't help me? <laughs> my wife is out here fucking a white boy with a 10-inch penis and you telling me that's your friend? I'm not going to lie. That does sound like something Kanye would say. Okay. Like that, like Charlemagne the God normally, you know, take it with a grain of salt regardless, right? Not the most reliable orator uh, in any meaningful capacity. But given what we've seen Kanye West talk about with respect to Pete Davidson's, with respect to Pete's Davidson, okay? Given what we know about uh, Kanye West and given what we know he has said about Pete's Davidson, I'm inclined to believe him on this one. But you're supposed to be coached! <laughs> He's screaming on the phone. Somebody help. <laughs> Entertaining. Yes. Entertaining. Sure. Hilarious. What am I supposed to do but laugh at that? So he's not funny. He just got a big dick. 10 inches is unreasonable. Motherfucker would fall over. Yeah, I don't think he has a 10-inch penis. Uh, but he definitely has a big one. A lot of people have talked about it. You know, he's a fat one. And, uh, you know, you don't love that, okay? Let's be real. That's not, you never want, that's just not a fun thing for your, for your baby mama, for, for thinking about your, your former wife and, and the mother of your children. Who's like very openly talking about it too. Like you have to be insanely confident. Okay. To begin with. And Kanye West certainly is not. Do, do you know what I'm saying? Like you already have to be like super confident to be able to not care about that sort of thing. But then Kanye West is also not a very confident person. So, uh, you know, it's just, this is probably obliterating him. 
So eight is average? No, man. What the fuck are you talking about? You've probably never seen an eight-inch cock, okay? That's like top echelon of porn stars. The fuck do you mean? People literally think like, people think that porn and the way that they fucking uh, shoot porn makes it seem like, uh, <laughs> makes it seem like everyone's got like 10 inches. Like those guys don't have 10 inches. Most of them have seven inches, okay? Which is on the bigger side. The average, I think, is like four inches or something. So don't worry, kings, okay? Your member is probably adequate. You should still learn how to eat pussy, though, regardless. It was okay to bring Ray J who railed his wife on stage with him. Man has something going on. Yeah, I mean, he's like talked weirdly about his mom too. Uh, which is which is very strange. Like he's never, I've never heard him say anything. Uh, like I've never heard him speak poorly about Donda ever, in, no matter how fucking manic he got. And in some of the interviews, like some of the recent interviews, like it's just not. He's not all there. Anyway, let's let's watch. Let's bring in now the CEO and national director of the Anti-Defamation League, Jonathan. 